Alrighty, my Apple fans, we finally got the iPhone and iPad working in OBS, so let's go. Hey folks, AJ the CEO here. This is first time stopping by the channel. Thanks for stopping by and on this channel. We focus on tips, training, strategies, reviews, and bills to help modernize your media ministry. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. So um, a lot of people were wondering about, hey, AJ, you talked about the Android and how to get the Android working with OBS and turning it into a webcam. What about the iPhone? What about the iPad? What about us Apple folks? Well, the best thing happened um, this past weekend, or it might have been um, Thursday, but NDI released their um, NDI camera for the iPhone and iPad, which was used to cost, but now they made it completely free. And there is a link in the description um, that I'll show you where you can get it to. But if I cut over here so that y'all can see how this all works. So if I come over here, like I have my iPad right now and as you can see I'm running the app and you can see my stuff right here if I switch over to this and now this is coming from the NDI camera on my iPad so again if I hold this up you can see this is my iPad and this is what's coming up so you just got to go ahead and go to that link go through the same steps that I showed in how to do this with the Android and this actually makes it easier because it's just an NDI source that you would need to pull in for your phone. And you install that and then that's pretty much it. Um, now, just like with any other source, you can layer that, put in another screen capture, do another NDI device that's coming from whatever presentation software that you want to use. It doesn't matter. You can have that here. So now everyone who has been live streaming from their iPhone or iPad, you can now integrate it into OBS so that you can add scripture and lyrics and everything like that. Now, I'm not going to repeat all the steps just because it's, well, nah, <laughs> let's go ahead and do it anyway. Let's cut over here to the screen. All right, I'm here on my screen here and you gotta make sure you have all of the um, NDI stuff plugged in. Your, the plugin so OBS can see it, all that other fun stuff, the runtime and everything like that. So now let's come up here and we're gonna do add an NDI source. We'll just call it iPad. And the good thing is compared to like the Android one, you don't have to get, know the IP address. It's actually just gonna show up. So if I hold this up here and I'll just call it iPad, there's our iPad, the NDI HX camera. Okay. And there we go. And then, you know, we come in here, just change, transform it to fit the screen. And as you can say, see, I need to shave. <laughs> But um, that's pretty much it, really straightforward. So again, the link is gonna be in the description for where you can download it. Again, it is free, they made this free. That is what I used. And that was one of the issues that I had with trying to do the, the Apple version of this because I didn't wanna buy a whole bunch of these. But obviously this is the free one, it works great. So check it out, the link in the description. If you like to, oh, and also please reference the other videos on how to do all this other stuff because this is, um, now that you have this source of camera, you can use all the other videos that we've done before um, to do scripture, lyrics, all that other fun stuff. You're just going to use your iPad or your iPhone as the camera that's going to OBS and OBS is going to be streaming instead of your phone. And this also opens up because so many people have iPhones and iPads. Now you can have multi-camera systems in your church as long as they're on the Wi-Fi and make sure your computer is fast enough. And we're going to be talking about that in a later video. So anyway, if you like this type of content, I appreciate a like, consider subscribing and hit that bell. That way you get notified when we come out with other videos to help modernize your media ministry. This is AJ. We will see you on the next video later.